Welcome back to the channel, y'all. In this video, I'm gonna show you guys another good product here to come back that pollen. Man, it's still falling, not quite as heavy as it was, kind of lightening up some. This is how I look on, kind of like a brown paint job. I'm gonna see the mother's ultimate hybrid ceramic detailer has the SIO2 wax technology. Ceramics, uh, bee boosters, y'all know y'all love that ceramic stuff. So let's get into it. Let's start with the top. The stuff comes out real thick. You saw how it kind of splatter. And to me, you could use it almost like a waterless car wash. It ain't nothing but a detailer, you know. Most detailers and waterless car wash is basically about the same thing, you know. You pretty much can use them anywhere. Wipe your car down. Some of the dust coming from the lawnmower, actually, as I cut grass and stuff, too. So, I got to note that some of it is pollen also. Also, some of it's coming from me as I cut the grass. So, that's how it is, man. All right, so here, I'm going to simply move this over and wipe this roof. You can see the pollen. Look here. There's still a lot of pollen still falling, man. Hey, it ain't gave up yet. It's still falling. It's still falling, man. So you got to stay on top of it. This is mainly my daily driver. This mother here is so good on gas, man. I ain't. I ain't too crazy about driving the SUVs that much. Burn too much gas, man. All of them. Once you drive a Honda, I tell you the honest truth, it's kind of hard to go back to driving something else. A Honda's so good on gas, man. Like them SUVs and stuff like that. Man, you ain't want to drive that stuff too much. Not coming from a Honda. <laughs> something to get 30 miles a gallon to. Shit, it's going to be kind of hard to go back to. The driving something to get by 18 highway, you know, stuff like when you're getting 30, 32 damn near on a Honda. All right, guys, hit this part. And y'all know I'm telling the truth. It's kind of hard to go back from a Honda. I'm thinking I'm just about giving me another Honda. I got to wipe my Tahoe off over there, too. Y'all stay tuned for that. Hope I get time to do it today. All right. That's my daily right here, though, man. That's my gas saver. This is the one I focus on a lot. I ain't, I ain't for buying a whole lot of gas, unnecessary gas, when I can drive something that's butt on gas, you know. Just don't make no sense to me. If I ain't got to do it, I ain't going to do it. I ain't going to buy a whole lot of unnecessary gas when I got something good on gas. <laughs> uh, to me, it just, just don't make no sense. The rags I use, the new rags come from Walmart. Yeah. It's good rags, man. Very super soft rags. I use them all the time. This stuff is slick, man. Yes, sir. Slick stuff. All right, check that out. I put a nice little gloss on it. Hmm. What thing about this color car I love? You can't tell when it's dirty, no way. You know, man, this car can go for weeks. You ain't got to do nothing to it, and the color it is, man, it's just going to look clean all the time. It's just where it is. It's that color, man. That color, man. That color stay clean, man. Yes, sir. It's just one of them metal tone type colors that, that just ain't going to gonna show a lot of dirt and stuff. So let's hit this part of the car back here. If I didn't already, so we're going to hit it anyway. All right. I don't take a lot of this stuff. It's a whole bottle. I only use it maybe two or three times. As an ultimate. You can get this from Walmart, I think. Yeah, if I'm mistaken, Walmart has this in there. I know Advanced Auto Parts has it also. I want to say it's around 15 bucks for a 24-ounce product. So definitely not bad at all. It's a really good one. I tell you, it's a really, really, really good product, man. All right, so let's go ahead and wipe it in here. And I try to keep my eye wiped down as well as my knee on and stuff too. This is my daily driver here though. Yes, sir. That's my daily driver here. Yeah. And 
you put stuff like this kind of help keep it slick, you know. Once you keep that paint slick, you got it. Uh, stay clean for long periods of time. You can see the gloss somewhat. But this car sort of like a metal tone color. So shine or not, I mean, basically look the way it look majority of the times, you know. Yeah, there we go, man. I ain't going to hold y'all too long, but yeah. This stuff does pretty good. And like I said, this color car don't really show a whole lot of dirt and grime like that. So, yeah, that's what it is, man. Look good, though. I ain't going to cap. Still look good. It's got a nice little gloss to it. It's just one of those type of colors that doesn't show that much uh, defects. Uh, it doesn't even show when it's dirty, man. I mean, like I said, you can go weeks with this color car. You can go weeks and it still look clean. That's really what I like about these type of colors. Hey, they look clean all the time. I take another car this color. It ain't the prettiest color in the world. I just like the fact it stay clean. You know, but it ain't no bad looking color either. You know what I'm I just like <laughs> it stay clean most of the time, you know. So that's why I like it. Shit, I don't care. If it were black or something like that, hell, it stay nasty all the time. Yeah, Y'all know how them black cars be, man. And the black wheels, like the black wheel covers, they kind of stay dirty, too. Uh, unfortunately, this time here is not that bad. That is a hub cap I fixed up. It ain't really that smooth or uh, nothing whatnot, but uh, it's all right, though. I ain't I'm complaining about it. This one I grabbed and fixed up to blend in with that one. Well, I might buy a set like that. It blend in, so it look almost factory. And that one look pretty close to factory back there. You can put a Honda sticker in the middle and make it look factory, you know. Because some of the, my factory Honda wheels chip. Got a chip on on light, so I said I might get a set of black ones like these. Like, they stay up there as long as you snap them up there good. No, they'll stay. Yep, somebody hit the curb and that was before I got it, you know. So I said I ain't going back try to find no Honda wheel. I'm just going to get some aftermarket ones that'll stay up here. They're going to be good enough for me, you know. That's how I'm going to do it. The ones that'll stay up here. <laughs> I want them in black. You ain't gonna be getting no Honda factory wheels in black. So, you know, you're gonna have to go with something like this. You want a black wheel. And, and you can't paint them that good, really. You can't paint them really that good. Cause I think those those wheel covers is dipped and something and bought back up and put under heat or something like that and dry. They're almost like they're dry, they dipped. You know, so you can paint them pretty good, but they ain't gonna look good as the, the ones bought black. Y'all know what I'm talking about. When you buy them black, they look different. Like, uh, let's say this one. I'll show you guys. The wheel covers are bought black. It's a difference. These bought black. See, like those? They bought black. See, you, you can't really paint them to look like that. Nah, ain't no way. You can't paint them to really look like that. Nah. Best to buy them if you can, you know. Just buy them like that. So anyway, y'all hit that subscribe, man. I'm up out of here, man. Peace.